let's take a look at a few things, Danielle, we can all get involved with that are happening right here in NWA. We're both excited about this one, I think. The Razorback softball team off to a great start to their 2024 campaign, and they've got a home stand kicking off tonight and lasting until Sunday. They'll be taking on the Bulldogs of Mississippi State. And there are several promotions that the university is doing along with this homestand. Uh, tonight, they're going to give away mini Bogle Park replicas. Tomorrow, there's going to be a post-game egg hunt. And then Sunday, Danielle, I know you're excited about this one. It's Women's Empowerment Day there at the stadium. Uh, and you're going to be there. I I'm going to be there. How did you get to host? I just, <laughs> I mean. <laughs> I don't know. It should, we should be flipped, I feel no. like, on that day specifically. No, it's going to be awesome. Yeah, it's going to be fun. Well, Artisphere is Northwest Arkansas's Art and Nature Festival, and it's seeking five local artists to beautify the fences around the Upper Ramble in Fayetteville. The project is being supported by Walton Art Center and the City of Fayetteville. The Upper Ramble site provides a blank canvas for the project. WAC is going to provide five foot by seven foot mesh canvases, upcycle Broadway banners, and they're going to give each selected artist $500 to help with the cost of their supplies. This project is open to all art mediums. you got to submit to Walton Art Center before midnight on Thursday, March 28th. So you got a little less than a week to get your submissions in. Uh, but I can't wait to see what they do with that new beautiful spot there in downtown Fayetteville. Uh, Danielle, we talk about this one every year. It's so exciting. The Amazium, their fundraiser called the Ungala is just the time for adults to go to the museum and let their inner child Have out. you done it before? Yes, you have. it's so fun. Absolutely. Uh, they have these uh, racers, race cars that go around the track, um, and, and basically everything that the kids usually do at the museum, you get to do. So super fun. The tickets are on sale right now. Um, it's, a, it's a great time. I would say head out there. As you can see on your screen, it's happening Friday, April the 19th tickets uh, available head out there and one more thing to talk about is happening this weekend this is the time travelers expo so you can take a step back in time this event happening on saturday from 10 to 5 at the rogers embassy suites and convention center there's going to be several vendors there's going to be clothing homemade goods handmade items tickets are ten dollars in advance twelve dollars for walk-ups last year we went to this event and it was like walking through memory lane a vintage a vintage store absolutely basically, right yes i came home with several t-shirts that you don't really see much anymore like mtv you know yeah yeah uh I think my son got Super Mario Brothers, which was right before that movie came out. So, like, it was very, you know, fun. So, uh, that one's happening there on Saturday at the Rogers Convention Center.